The suspect in a deadly shooting in Pensacola faced a judge today on charges of homicide and possession of a weapon by a convicted felon. Daryl Walker arrested on Friday in Panama City for the murder of his wife at a home on Meatson Drive last Wednesday. He was returned to Escambia County yesterday. WEAR's Aubrey Spears has gone over the latest court documents in the case. Aubrey, what do they say? It's in this four page report where we learn Walker didn't call 911 for help, but instead called others to come to his apartment last Wednesday morning. Escambia County deputies rushed to the Aquaporta apartment complex on Meadson Road last Wednesday after reports that a woman had been shot and killed. The woman's husband was nowhere to be found. This warrant reveals on that morning, Daryl Walker called someone around five in the morning saying he messed up and needed them to come to the apartment. The warrant goes on to say Walker told that person repeatedly, quote, she grabbed the gun. When that witness arrived at the apartment, the report says they had to knock several times before Walker opened the door. Inside, the report says the witness saw Walker's wife laying on the ground covered in blood. They told deputies Walker was also covered in blood and went to his wife's body reaching down to hug her before saying he needed to go and he couldn't go back to jail. The witness says Walker then left the apartment with the gun. Law enforcement searched for days, finally finding Walker in Panama City where he was arrested. Today, a judge ordered Walker to have no contact with the witnesses in this case or his wife's family. He was given no bond on the homicide charge. Aubrey Spears, WEAR News.